If you bought a firearm, ammo, fuel for your boat, or even some new fishing tackle, thank you. You helped chip in for wildlife conservation in Wyoming. For the coming year, the Wyoming Game and Fish Department can get reimbursed for up to $19 million in revenues generated by the federal Pittman-Robertson Wildlife Restoration and Dingle Johnson Sport Fish Restoration Act. Wyoming can get reimbursed for eligible projects up to $5.3 million in sport fish restoration funds and up to $13.8 million in Pittman-Robertson Wildlife Restoration Funds. Game and Fish Director Scott Talbot says the money is provided on a 25-75% split, with Game and Fish paying the 25% of any eligible work. It's an opportunity to do big things for the public. We're using some of that money to restore our conservation camp for conservation education. We use some of that money for uh, our Laramie office. We use that money in all of our day-to-day -day wildlife management activities, and it's a significant portion of our budget. Talbot says the money amounts to about 30 percent of the department's annual budget. The revenue is managed by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service and is derived from excise taxes paid by the hunting, shooting, boating, and angling communities on firearms, bows and ammunition, sport fishing tackle, some boat engines, and small engine fuel. And while the money doesn't go as a blank check to the state, it's divvied up between the states for eligible projects that conserve wildlife. Game and Fish does not receive any general tax revenue. Other than this revenue source, almost all of the rest of Game and Fish funding comes from the sale of hunting and fishing licenses. Pittman Robertson Dingle Johnson money is only eligible for certain projects, including restoring and managing wildlife and sport fish populations, fish and wildlife research, obtaining data to direct regulations, acquiring property for habitat and or access, Habitat restoration, hunter education, fish stocking for recreation, and providing boating access. These are programs the public regularly identifies as important to them. And with up to $19 million in funding, these programs enable the department to provide the public with a world-class wildlife resource and some of the best hunting and fishing in the U.S. This is Ray Hageman with the Wyoming Game and Fish Department.